Good morning. It is Monday morning. We are on week four. So I have been doing pretty well. Still have to accept that a good chunk of it is water weight. I don't want to get my like hopes up too high and think this is going to pace the same way because that's always what gets me down. But I'm starting the morning with half a can of liquid death. I This is a liquid death. They're armless Palmer, so it's a uh, lemonade iced tea sweetened with agave. And I drank half of it last night, but I didn't finish it, so I'm finishing it today. And let's go on with the rest of the week. It is 12.20, and I'm gonna figure out breakfast. I need to eat this fruit, so I have these plum cots. I think I'm gonna have one. Ah, oh, there's no nutritional value on it. I'll have one. All right, for breakfast, I have this peach plum thingy to jig, and I have a single breakfast burrito, not burrito, because it's too much that I can't fold it, taco. It has two eggs, some white onion, and half a serving of turkey pepperoni, and a little bit of ketchup. I might need a fork, I might have to eat this. I'm gonna try this fruit though, because I've never heard of it. A peach plum, it's weird, I don't know if I like it. Mmm, the pepperoni's good. I should have done this sooner. It also has cottage cheese. It is four o'clock and your girl is hungry. So let's make lunch. I know I need to clean out my freezer. So I'm starting with finishing these air fried tenders. I'm also gonna have a handful of sweet potato fries. All right, what am I eating for lunch, you ask? I have a gigantic salad. It's kind of gigantic, it's not that gigantic. It has apples, balsamic vinegar, lettuce, some carrots, some red onions, and some cottage cheese. And I have a handful of chicken tenders, and some sweet potato fries, and some barbecue sauce. Let me flip it and show you. We've got our salad. Sweet potatoes, chicken tendies, and barbecue sauce. I'm about to do something I haven't done in a very long time and I don't really want to do with the weather. I think I'm gonna go for a run. Very short, very slow. A beginner run just to get me back into the speed of things, but it's that time. I'm not excited. All right, I'm changed and ready to go. I think the last time I ran was in the winter. It is now almost fall, so very, very long time. I really don't wanna do this, but I don't know why I'm doing it. I know why I'm doing it, it's because I have a half marathon in January. Let's go. It is 10.30 and I already put my computer to charge, but I'm getting hungry. I made myself a side salad, like the same exact salad I had uh, for lunch, but I'm still hungry. So I'm gonna have this fruit bar from Trader Joe's. I believe it was 100 calories. They're 120 calories. So I'm gonna have one of these and hopefully that ties me over for the rest of the night. It is Tuesday morning, it's 10 a.m. I have a couple of things to do. I My stomach is feeling large. It's feeling bloated. So I think uh, for breakfast, I kind of just want a cup of coffee. So I think that's what I'm gonna do. I don't know how I'm feeling. My body's just not feeling it today. It's not feeling healthy. It's already feeling like bloated and icky and just everything else in between. Ugh. Oh, it's 11.30, got my coffee. Just finished walking my dog, it is hot out. Oh. And I am debating doing intermittent fasting because they just keep appearing on my TikTok. So now I'm genuinely thinking about it, which sucks because I feel like if I go too hard, I'm gonna give up easily, but we'll see. I'll think about it over the week. And if at the end of the week, I still feel like I should try it, I'll try it next week. All right, I finished my coffee. It is 12.30 and I'm going to make myself lunch. I'm trying to not think of meals as breakfast, lunch, and dinner. I'm trying to just think of it as eating when I'm hungry, but it's really hard to change my mindset. So I'm going to do my best to stop saying like breakfast, lunch, and dinner and saying it's time to eat, but we'll see how long that sticks. For this meal, <laughs> I plan on making a taco bowl, so you'll see how it goes. I have my taco seasoning. 
I have a pound of ground beef here. And I also have some cauliflower rice that's supposed to have Mexican flavors that I got from Trader Joe's, which I'll show you now. Spicy Mexican style rice cauliflower, and I'm gonna put it all on a bed of lettuce. Hopefully it's good, I've never tried this before. Hello, it is Wednesday afternoon. I actually forgot to take a Wednesday morning video. So it's Wednesday afternoon. I'm back from work at 7 p.m. For breakfast, I had two Pop-Tarts and a uh, Greek yogurt, because my coworker was talking about Pop-Tarts and it was just really giving me a craving for it. And for lunch, I had a bento box and the it was a salmon filet and like these cream cheese puff katsu things. And now it's seven and I bought a burrito from Trader Joe's to eat for dinner. But first, I will go for a run because my running days technically are Mondays, Wednesdays, Thursdays, and Saturdays, according to the schedule I found online. So I really don't wanna to run today. <laughs> but let's go, three miles. Oh, I got a stitch on this run. For those who don't know what a stitch is, it's like a cramp in your side. And it's been a long time since I have felt that, so hydration. Thursday. I went to Starbucks, but I'm really not craving coffee. I don't want like a dairy based drink. So I got a strawberry acai refresher, no lemonade. I'm feeling really tired. Um, my legs were really hurting this morning, but as I've been moving, it's gone away. I don't know if I want to run today or not because of how they feel, but I'm still figuring it out. And that's about it. I don't have anything exciting today. I'm gonna do my best to eat my best. Yay. It is 1.30 in the afternoon. I have not drank this yet, so I'm gonna start drinking this. I'm gonna make myself some food, not breakfast or lunch, some food. I think I'm going to make tortilla with egg and pepperoni, a little bit of cheese, and then I'm gonna call the hospital because they charge me a lot of money on a bill for a high severity visit, and if you watch my vlog about my hospital visit, it was not treated as high severity. I was there for like nine hours. There was like two to three hours between every time someone would check on me and they didn't give me any medicine. So I'm definitely gonna see if I can fight that.
slow. I didn't go slow. Some woman stopped me for directions, which is fine. She was like old and stuff. But I had to stand there for five minutes explaining it. So my run app was like, you ran really slow. And in reality, I was trying to be a helpful citizen. But now the run looks bad. <sighs> Water. I cooked this in a little olive oil. I added red onions, some pesto, and some cottage cheese because it was a little bland. Ooh, let's eat. This is a big meal. There is the plate. Happy Friday. It is Friday morning. I have a half day because it's Labor Day weekend and we have a wedding tonight in Philly. So I'm packing for Philly and this is just gonna be a long ride. <laughs> Let's go. We've got my usual coffee. It is 11, 17 and I'm wrapping up some work and packing. probably charge us for. It's just $10 on them. Enjoy the stay here at Kimpton. The view. And the shower. That's the room. These shoes are too big. On to the wedding. Look. Very slimming. The eye look. E. <laughs> and I only have 6,000 steps, so I ate a lot at the wedding, so I'm gonna get some steps in. Yeah, I got the whole gym to myself. This is kinda nice. Wow, did not expect that. Mm -hmm. 